Hi guys, welcome to Code Artisan Lab. This is video number 38 for hotel management system in Laravel. In this video, what we are going to do, we will <coughs> show the all customer submitted testimonial on the home page as a slider. Okay, like we are showing this banner. After the gallery section, we will show all the testimonials with customer name in the slider. Okay, so let's uh, let's do that. So what we need to do, we need to fetch the all testimonial in the home controller, then we will do the other things. So let's open the, so let's open our app HTTP controller and then after that we will open our home controller. Okay, and in the home controller we will fetch the data of the testimonials. Okay, so testimonials, very long this is quite long name okay and this will be our model okay now we can fetch this data so let's open our home template let's open our where it is home okay now what i will do i will just copy this slider section okay in the after the gallery section so i will copy this slider section so here is the gallery so here is the gallery section I will just copy and paste that so I will paste here okay and <clears throat> so I will name it I will name it let's say testimonials okay and this ID will be here okay and this ID will be here also okay so now let's check this so refresh the page and here we have this slider okay now we need to fetch the data so in the uh, this is the element that we are going to slide so what i will do i will we just need the uh, i will just paste this thing okay quotes this kind of thing so i will copy this okay and paste it here the place in the place of image okay now let's copy this paste it here okay now we will do the same thing here okay refresh the page and here we have so this is the data okay but it should be it should be it should be in the center okay so let's say figure class center so I will copy this and paste it here and paste it here and uh, paste it here okay now refresh the page okay i will give some margin padding so what i will do uh, let's say padding 5 okay and let's add some color so bg you can say light okay and let's say border okay so this is the border and i will also do the margin bottom okay so here is the thing let's add bg dark okay so that will show the cursor but we need to add text white okay so here we are showing the testimonial data and here we will show the username okay so let's show the data so we need to just loop this thing so for each dollar testimonials as dollar testy and i'll remove all the other things so this will be here remove this and i will say end for each and i'll just add this active class if if our let's say if our index is zero okay it means if, if this is first element then we will apply the active class so if index equal equal to 0 then we will say and if this thing okay so this this is working now okay now let's add here the data dollar test t okay so what is the name of our uh, so name is testy content 
okay so let's add here it is here. refresh the page so here you can see that okay we just need to okay now we have data and these are all the testimonials that it is working now we need to show the customer name so we didn't created the relation between the testimonial model and the customer model so let's create the uh, let's create the relationship between the testimonial and the user so what i will do so every testimonial belongs to some customer okay so what i will do so like booking like booking we will say this kind of thing okay so this belongs to customer it means the testimonial belongs to customer okay like booking belongs to customer same as testimonial belongs to customer and here what we will do i will just simply i will say some famous uh, what it is showing some famous in source title so i'll just remove this site and here what we will do so customer customer and what is the name of the what is the name field let's say uh, we have uh, where is the customer model yeah customer so is the full name so okay so we will get the full name sorry so here I have removed the home page from the subline. Okay, I will reopen. So where it is here. Okay, now let's refresh the page. And here you can see that Alex Lee, Alex Lee, and Alex Lee. Okay, so this is the thing. You can simply add here the BG secondary. Okay, so this is showing nicely. And here we will also show, uh, let's say, text white. Okay, so now it is working. So you can give a heading also. So let's add here testimonials. Testimonials. Okay, let's copy the heading from the gallery section because we need the symmetry. So I will add here the heading, this kind of thing. Okay, so this is testimonials and I will remove the border because border is not adjusting with the testimonial so I will remove this border. Okay, so this is fine now and let's add margin top bottom. Let's add margin from top not bottom. So this is the thing. So this is gallery section, this is services, gallery testimonials okay so we have uh, created our testimonial section completely but accept the admin management uh, in the next video we will create the we will manage the uh, testimonials from the admin okay uh, if we publish the testimonial from the admin then then it will show here else it will not show here okay we will do these things in the next video okay so thank you so much for watching this video please understand this carefully practice this uh, uh, more and more times okay till you not uh, till you fully understand these things okay and please subscribe share this channel okay so thank you so much for watching this video thank you